Hey guys, it's Kate. Welcome back to day three of Vlogoween. Today I probably have one of my favorite videos that I film for you, and that is a Target haul. So of course everybody has out their fall and Halloween merchandise, and I have been making purchases here and there. Um, the stuffies that I had in my last video I got from Walgreens, I purchased a couple of things at Walmart, but I really went whole hog at Target like I usually do, and I figured that I would show those purchases with you, or share, share them with you, show them to you today. So we're going to go ahead and get started, um, and there probably might... There probably will, might be more than one of these in this vlog -oween. We will see. I will try to restrain myself. Um, so starting with the dollar spot items, got a couple of goodies in here. First being these really fun headbands. So I thought it would be fun at work, since I am a teacher, for me to wear different Halloween themed headbands. I don't think I can necessarily get away with wearing my ears. But I thought that these would be a fun alternative to that. And they were only a dollar. So I did pick up these cat ones. And they've got some lace. Which just might be a little difficult to see. But that was a dollar. Can't go wrong there. And in that same vein, I also got a pumpkin one. So I'm sure these are for little kids. But I am a big kid that is a little kid at heart. So I love that. And... Like I said, a dollar for a fun accessory, even if I wear it a couple of times, that is money well spent to me. Next couple of things are some washi tape. I am a huge planner enthusiast, a huge crafter, a scrapbooker, and their dollar spot gets me every time with their craft supplies. So this might be a little tricky to show on camera. I actually think I'm going to... Um, I actually cannot take it out of the box, out of the wrapping without cutting it, so I hope that that's going to show. Um, but basically, it actually has the image of what it looks like there on the top, so you can see that this is a row of pumpkins, and that was a dollar. I also got this one, which let me make sure it's scooched to the bottom, so you can see it is fall foliage, or just some really pretty fall colored leaves also got this one these are glitter sorry for the noise i'm trying to push the washi tape down so you can see the image on the top there so this one's some gold glitter leaves and hopefully the glare from the sun isn't making it difficult to see this one's going to be very easy to show you these are four different glitter tapes there is a kind of like a wine color a deeper red, a gold, and a silver. And again, I thought that those would be perfect for my planner or crafting, card making, what have you. And just for a dollar, you guys can't beat that. So I did pick up four of those. Last thing from the dollar spot are these candles. And I just about died when I saw these because they look like little coffees um, or little teas. They have this fun lid the little sippy cup lid that makes it look like a drink. I just could not. So this first one is pumpkin slice latte. And these were $3, I believe. Yep. $3. And they just have this fun little lid. That's the candle. Um, and it smells exactly like it says, pumpkin spice latte. I also got pumpkin caramel latte. It's so funny that I'm so obsessed with these and I don't even drink coffee. What's wrong with me? and spiced cider. I thought this one was precious. So as soon as my Mr. and Mrs. candle burns down, I'm almost done with that one. I'm going to put out my fall scents and I figured I'd start with those little mini lattes. They're so cute. I also, on a previous trip, got a whole bunch of stuff from the dollar section that I used to make Halloween goodie bags for my students. I've already put those in the bags seal them up and took them to school so I do not have them to show you but I got fun bubble wands, uh, fun glasses that make it look like they've got monster eyes or spooky eyes, pencils, erasers. There's a whole bunch of stuff for gift bags or goodie bags there right now that you can get. So I got a whole bunch of that stuff too. But moving on to the clothing and other fun Halloween items. First thing I also got these from the dollar spot are these socks. 
They are gray with orange and white stripes. Perfect for keeping your feet warm in the chilly weather of Florida. This next set of pajamas is precious and they had an orange set that said you had me at pumpkin spice and they didn't have it in my size. I was a little heartbroken but then I saw this one and I'm like okay this is pretty cute too. So it comes with these little shorts that have ghosts all over them, little ruffle bottom shorts and then the top says hey boo. <laughs> So cute! I am in love. Hey boo! Hey! <laughs> so I might have to go on to Target.com and order the You Had Me at Pumpkin Spice set, but this one will get me through this Halloween season at least. Um, I also got this tank top and I'm not even mad about the amount of Halloween stuff I purchased. <laughs> This one here is so cute. It's a muzzle tee in a dark gray color with pumpkins all over the front and the back, which I appreciate because sometimes the graphics are just on the front, but I like it to have the graphic on the back as well. And this one was $12.99 for a cute pumpkin muscle tee. Next one that I got, I don't know why I find so much joy in this, but I do. And it says trick or tacos. So instead of trick or treat, it's trick or tacos. And I think that this is fabulous and is perfect to wear on Tuesdays when it's Taco Tuesday. And this was $16.99. I just think it's really funny <laughs> for 16 bucks. Ugh, they sucker me in. The last piece of Halloween clothing, as far as like fun tops that I got, is this jumper here. And it is bright orange, like a pumpkin, and has the jack-o'-lantern face instead of the classic circles or triangles the eyes are hearts which i think is really sweet and it's so soft it's by the line grayson threads and it is identified as sleepwear but i'm gonna wear this out and about i'm sure this was 19.99 so uh on one of the more pricier things i got but still 20 bucks for a fun halloween jumper i don't think is bad Next couple of things I got were actually in the clearance bin, which I was super excited about. I did get this pair of fashion tights. They were originally $10, but I got them for three. And I thought paired with any of those tops, that pumpkin sweatshirt and a denim skirt would just be really fun and festive. So I thought that these were really cool. And same for these. These are the Exhilaration Seamless Leggings. They were originally $14. I got them for 7 you can see that they are solid or opaque at the top and then they have a fun mesh on your calf. So again, with a fun Halloween top, I just think that this is really fun, as I've said, for the weekend. Super casual, but very festive. And then I got myself some underwear that was on sale too. So woo, that's exciting. Not anything to do with Halloween, but that is everything I wanted to show you guys today. I love Target. I just can't get enough. I go all the time and this was from a couple of trips um, and I'm sure I'll be back. Like I said, I'm sure I'll have another Halloween haul for you guys if you would like to see it. But I hope you enjoyed today's, today's video regardless. Please give it a thumbs up if you did. Subscribe below if you are not subscribed already so you can stick around for Vlogoween and I will see you guys tomorrow. Bye!